guys welcome back to my channel I ordered my first ever plant tissue cultures and I'm gonna be documenting my experience and process going through this whole thing so today the shipment came in so let's do an unboxing video I ordered my plant tissue cultures from Orange Lake Nursery in Florida. I asked a few of my friends and a few plant connections where they got theirs from and this was what was recommended to me. If you guys have any other places that you've ordered plant tissue cultures from and had great experiences, comment them below so I can check out different places to get tissue cultures from. I paid to have mine um, have cold protection because it's cold in Missouri, which is where I'm located. I'm glad I did because we're under a freeze warning and I just did not want to risk these poor little babies getting killed in the cold. So far, my experience has been really good with this nursery. They shipped these out on Friday and they got to me on Tuesday. So I would say that's really good shipping experience. Now we'll see how they were packaged. Okay, so it's got like the proper packing to keep it warm. It's got this insulation stuff that I also use when I ship plants. So we're off to a good start. Let's get to opening these. Okay, underneath that is brown packing. Very secure. Well, how cute is this? I didn't know it was coming with this, but it's a little pot. How cute. It even has like their logo on it. I didn't order pots. I don't know if this is like complimentary or what. There was a heat pack up on this side, so that's good to know. And it looks like the tissue cultures all came in one little brown bag. I'm not surprised. I think they're going to be pretty tiny. Scan me for instructions. I like that. That's really nice to have, actually. I've read, they have a really nice article on plant tissue cultures on their website, if you order from them, about how to acclimate them and steps to take. And I've also watched other YouTube videos and listened to podcasts about acclimating tissue cultures as well. So let's go ahead and open this. Okay, here's the Fred Anderson. As you can tell, he's in his goo. He looks like he's got pretty good roots right off the bat. He looks healthy to me. I don't really notice anything concerning yet, so I'm happy about that. There are the philodendron red congos. There's five of them in there. These guys are a little harder to tell. They're pretty small. I can't tell how big their root structures are. But I'm pretty excited about this. So, Okay, so I'm pretty impressed with their packaging. I'd give it, honestly, a 9 out of 10, maybe 10 out of 10. We'll see how these guys are when they get to growing. But I am so excited. So these are the first two I ordered. I almost went out of control and ordered a ton but as since these are my first ones i decided to keep it small and sweet and i'm gonna take you along the journey with me so now that i have these for the first two days i'm not going to do anything with them it says to leave them in the bags in their like tissue culture gel so it says to keep them in a stable environment so i'm actually going to keep them right back here in this grow cabinet on the top shelf for two days and then we're going to move on to the next step and i will post a video for that go ahead and like and subscribe below for more content like this and follow along with my plant tissue cultures and hit the little bell for notifications